EasyMont.com. Use code CUTE at checkout. It's easy, fast, legit. Stop gambling your money. Go save your money. Go have the fun you want. Get the team you want. Get the coins that you want. All right, guys. Welcome back. Quarterback tier list short and to the point. If you like to hit the like button, these videos are already on the channel. Let's go check them out. Now, let's go ahead and get started. Quarterback tier list. It's going to be short and to the point. So if you like to hit the like button, it really supports the channel. Subscribe if you're new. So we have two more tier lists coming out today. We're going to do safeties and we're going to do wide receivers. Both those videos will be out in the next couple of hours. So keep a lookout for them. Let's get started here. If you have a question about a quarterback now on this list, by the way, just ask me. I'll help you. But I only do quarterbacks that are kind of relevant. I mean, some of these are not even relevant. But I don't want to go down to the goals and stuff and waste your time talking about players that are just complete trash. So let's go ahead and get started here. So I am going to clear up the picture for you. And I'm going to tell you, your borrow is going to be the best to be here because it's release, right? So Justin Herbert, him, Josh Allen, and where's he at? Lamar because of a different reason. All these guys are going to be here, okay? None of them have great thresholds. 85 throwing accuracy. Short, medium, deep guys. You will not miss throws anymore. That is the threshold you need. These guys do not have that threshold. But Joe is better than all these quarterbacks because of his release, okay? So to clear up this core elite pitcher, Joe is the best release. Lamar is only on this tier because of his running. You can pick up 60 yards at a time with his speed this year. So maybe you even want to sub him in for a couple of situations and then sub him out. But he's going to miss throws. All of these quarterbacks here are going to miss so many throws. You're going to be mad. You're going to hate the game. You're going to say, oh, this game's trash. It's because you don't understand thresholds. Now, going down a tier, you can put Aaron Rodgers on this tier as well. Going down a tier of people that don't have even 80s or even throw power, I mean, these are getting really bad here. Um, this list here are just unusable quarterbacks. And I uh, would not recommend you picking any of them up. Now, CJ Stroud is going to have the same release as Joe, but more athletic. So I'll put him in B tier. He's going to be uh, a faster Joe, but still misses throws. You're going to get mad about it. Will is going to be here as well. And he's going to hit about the same thresholds they do. And he's nothing special. He's going to be a pass if you have him. It's time to upgrade. Warren Moon and Jamison Winston here, the 84s, sorry, the 84s. Um, let me tell you something right now. Moon is going to be here because he has a little bit better, like, throwing or pressure. He gets different thresholds. He's going to be the best of B tier. But if you guys say, well, you have too many people in B tier, guys, it's because you're going to get the same result. They're going to miss the same passes. Not having 80 short, medium, or deep accuracies, you're going to regret that. You're going to hate them. And trust me, you're not going to be happy. Okay. So, with that being said, wow. Uh, we got Bryce Young. Guess what he does? He misses throws too. Okay. Uh, how do you help that? It's going to be gift wrap. You put gift wrapped on some guys, it's going to help them. Are they going to be accurate every time? No. Is it going to help? Yes. So, okay. Jordan Love is also going to fall in this category because he doesn't hit 85. He's going to miss throws just like they do. So is Kenny. Kenny has a bad release, by the way, but he has good throwing power. He's athletic, at least. He's good. So I do like this card, but he's not going to be a world of difference when it comes to accuracy, guys. You're going to get mad. You really are. And guess what? RG3, same thing. Super athletic. I get it. He's fun. Big name. Fun name. But he misses so many throws. It's stupid. It's even throwing the run is horrible. Uh, short, medium, deep accuracy is absolutely trash. And you're going to miss throws just like the other ones because he does not hit the 85. He does not get any good abilities besides jukebox, which is like for a runner. So if you need a runner, he's the best runner. He's free. And let me tell you something. He's going to be worth getting because of he's free, right? Uh, but if you're not going to run around, he's no good. You might as well not even crying for him, all right? Now, Jamison Winston's going to be A tier because he hits the 85 thresholds. He's going to hit his throws. He's going to hit short, medium, deep. If you're tired of his throws, go get James, and he's cheaper than Moon. But Moon is S tier, guys, because he gets Gunslinger. So because of abilities, Moon's the best. It's not close. He has the thresholds. 
you're saying, well, I still miss Pat's moon. Guess what? Um, not as many as you would with somebody else. And I will tell you that probably quarterbacks should miss some throws to be, like, realistic. But I will say, if you guys want to stop missing throws, go get these two quarterbacks. You want the best with the best abilities, go get Moon. If you want to run around, go get RG3 because he gets jukebox. Uh, that's going to be it, guys. Rest of these quarterbacks, that's my answer for you. So if you have any questions, let me know down below. That was short and to the point. I got safety materials coming up next and wide receiver. I'll see you in those videos. And these videos are already on the channel.